This is kneeling hold with breathing. So if I have a client who puts their arms up over their head and take a breath and they're not getting the breath I need. I want to work on them breathing in that position. So if they're dialed in in other positions but having a hard time just with arms overhead, then I want to start them from a kneeling position. If I start them from tall kneeling, it's usually because they are twos and above on the leg raise, the hurdle step, the uh, inline lunge, all the things that are unilateral exercises. I'll put, if they're ones on that, I'll put them in a half kneeling position to work on that position. If they're ones on the push up or the squat, uh, then I'll have them in a tall kneeling position. Uh, to start the exercise. If they're twos on everything else and shoulder mobility is the only issue, either way, it really doesn't matter. Um, but the gist, we got her in a kneeling position, arms up over her head. We want to make sure she's in a good posture, ribs down, get the arms, get her in the best position that we can and start to breathe in that position. So if she's having a hard time breathing in that position, one thing I might want to do is just bring these arms down a little bit to just relax and I just want her to know as she exhales each time to just move the arms back just a little bit and maybe not this session or maybe not next session but over time she'll get more and more comfortable with breathing in this kneeling position with a good solid canister here getting full 360 expansion and getting those arms back and over her head. If there's a mobility issue there that's beyond breathing then we're going to be working on that additionally and that will help with uh, combine with this exercise over time to clear both or one of the other.